All right, folks. We are back with some more EU3. Now, you may be wondering, hey, I thought that this was, you know, the series was over. Well, I thought it was, too, but some dude who was awesome found me an old copy of the game and emailed it to me. So, I, I was thinking about mentioning his name, but then I wasn't sure if he'd want that or not. So, he knows who he is. Dude, props. You are, like, my favorite person ever. Uh, I had to load from an older save game. I, it, we only got thrown back, like, nine months because uh, the game crashed last time, um, and actually I'm not even entirely sure if this, I'm not sure if I fixed the bug with the missions in this, like I'm not sure if this version has that fixed, uh, so we'll see, uh, but yeah, at least we can play it, so let's just get on right in there, um, let's just get on right, oh yeah, I remember I was at war with these guys, Ew. I remember wanting peace with them, because... It was useless, because I didn't want to lose all these armies. Yes. And some people po some people pointed out to me that the reason I lost is, e is that even with a significant tech advantage, 25 to um, 28, uh, it's still, uh, they outnumber me so much that it, uh, that difference doesn't really, make, doesn't really matter. Um, I have beaten out stronger armies with less men with the same tech difference but I guess the mod changes it or something uh, point being is that it doesn't work is the, and then I, I was overestimating the power of my army um, so that's good to know it's good to know that I I can occasionally still be humbled occasionally so you know take that as you will Jura is under siege hopefully we'll deal with these guys on our way home yeah, they go there. But yeah, so I indeed um, can be uh, overconfident sometimes. And that happened to me this time. So it's okay, it's okay. You know, I can handle it. I can handle it. I can handle a little, uh, a little being, you know, uh, humiliated and put in my place. Uh, the forts are definitely our strength. Defensive is way better than offensive. At least usually. There we go. Now I just gotta... What's my mission again? Protect against Ossetania. Alright. How big is their army? Well, how big are incomes? I do outnumber out income them. Let's see armies. They have a large army. I'm gonna cancel that mission when I can. When's that? 63 is three years. Well, it might be worth building up an army. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I actually need to reduce the amount that I'm paying my soldiers considerably. 13.4 sounds good. Yeah. Ooh, that's better. I'm actually gaining money per year instead of losing money per year. Sounds good to me. Sounds very good to me. Mm -hmm. One thing I still need to do is a monasticism. Uh, I don't. I don't really care. One thing I still need to do is uh, get some new headphones. Uh, the ones I had were broken, so right now I'm using my. Uh, speakers so if you hear some like uh, reverb not reverb but um, echo from the music or something or any uh, game audio that's probably it and yeah, neither of these guys like me enough yeah like me more please but yeah if you hear some like background noise or echo or whatever it's from uh, the fact that I'm now using uh, speakers instead of headphones, at least for a little while, uh, we'll see how it goes. I don't think it should be too bad, but I think we should be okay. If it's you know if it if it, if it becomes a problem, then I'll work to uh, fix it. Southern Sea of Japan, interesting. So we know all the way about over here. I, mean, I knew we knew about a good bit of the east, but you know, still, what's Tianwan's tech? tech? It's uh, 25, so they're not that far behind us, actually. Of course, they're lagging in other areas. So, who knows? Who knows?
You can have those road networks. All right, interesting. I need to build more trade and production. I don't have the money. Well, Merchant's Guild. That's important, but you know, I'll build a. Yeah, I'll build this. Build a couple of these. I don't have a lot of money, but I still have enough money to burn through that I feel confident uh, building stuff. I feel, you know, safe. So, I think we'll be fine. I think we'll be just fine. Early colonization happened to us. Yeah, it happened last time. So we get more colonies, or more colonists, but uh, we have nowhere really we can use them. So, uh, I don't know what we're going to do with that. I can always colonize America a little bit later on, but I don't know. No one's really seemed to grab any of it, really, so far. So, you know, we'll see. If no one takes any grab for America, or no one grabs at America, then, you know, hey, it's if it's open for the taking, then sure, and apparently these guys are at war with these guys for reasons. Uh, but one of my diplomats died. That's not good. My only advisor died. Great. Need to find the one that were the, the dip diplomat. There we go. Level 5 still. Level 6 really is so much better, but oh well. I can live without him. We're not losing much infamy per year, though. Ah, uh, oh god, I hate... I hate stability drops. They're not as bad in this mod, but in the regular game, ooh, they're something fierce. I'm probably, I'm not sure if I'm going to make this part the full 30 minutes, mainly because, ooh, lots of money. Mainly because I'm very tired. Uh, I've had a long day. Uh, I got my uh, wisdom teeth out recently, and today was the first day I could eat, so I've eaten a lot. <laughs> um, see, I've eaten a lot, and um, I'm very, very regretful of that now. I should not have eaten that much. Uh, send troops. Yeah, I should not have eaten that much. I should have uh, gone back into the food world with grace and with style. Uh, but no, instead, I just like dug in and now am basically in a food coma, if we can put it that way. Uh, it's <laughs> it's not very fun, but I, I'll, I'll live. I'll live. I'll be fine. No, we lost our general guy that I didn't really care about actually so yeah this video will probably be 15 minutes just cause I wanted to get something out there uh, to let you guys know that indeed uh, the um, series was not over is actually still continuing uh, as strongly as it ever was thanks to the good graces of the YouTube gods mainly that guy that sent me the link so, once again, props to him. But yeah, it, the fates just kind of came together and they were like, you're not done with this game, and that's generally how it happened. That is generally how it happened. Not specifically how it happened, just generally. Alright, grab them one more time, we should be good. You guys are still my, yep. Send one more. There we go. At 200, you guys. 198. Nah, that's good enough. There's more than good enough. Moria, peace with the Roman Empire. Yeah, the Roman Empire should really just kind of get their act together and start conquering again, because they they have a lot of cores and a lot of places. Like they could get some of these places probably pretty easy. Uh, get all that, then you've probably got, you've probably got the, um, you can get this from Genoa pretty easy, probably. Uh, the Ottomans are distracted right now, so they really shouldn't even have a tr problem with that. Uh, so yeah, they should, they should do that. We're getting cleansing of her heresy against Aragon. Uh, it's probably some, some bug, because they are, oh, yes, sweet. Sea Island is now a core. Awesome. Can I join into the HRE? Yeah, all right. 
All these are other ones already are, right? Yeah. Alright, so that's officially a member of the HRE now. Nice! Only ones that aren't are these two. Are these? You... Are not. Join it. So we are now accepting Danish. That's good. Very good. You are... And you are not. So now they all are. Now all these places are official parts of the HRE. These two still aren't. And Nevers was the next by Orleans. All right. So now we've got two major powers in this area. We've got Ostania, which is former England, and we've got Orleans. Uh, with you know the ever present threat of me kind of coming in here a little bit, but you know this is not really my area; it's theirs. But you know, like right around here, uh, I could, we could see some interesting conflicts in the future because I'd like to ally with Ostania, but they wouldn't say yes. They trust us utterly, uh, they have a tarnished reputation, uh, they love us, but they still wouldn't, you know, accept an alliance, probably because they see us as potential rivals uh, in this area, or in just in general, abroad, you know, we actually have a core, not a core, claim on them, uh, I would like to go to war with them eventually, but right now it just doesn't seem like the smart idea. Peasants war in, in the Teutonic Order. The Teutonic Order has really just kind of taken a beating uh, over the last few years from us, from a couple people. Now they've got a... Uh... Oh, we completed a mission. Sweet. Oh, now we got this personal union malarkey that I'll have to... I'll have to um, mess with the files to get that properly again. Uh, I'm gonna... Uh, I don't want to mess with the files because that'll maybe screw everything up but I think we'll be okay I think we'll be fine yeah we should be fine if I uh, mess with them because uh, that's not what screwed it up last time that's yeah it's not what, what crashed the game last time was not messing with those files it was messing with some other files and I won't mess with those files again I'll just mess with the original files that fixed the bug for the the thing so yeah, I hope that made sense. It didn't to me. But then again, my brain just kind of works that way. Moria, peace. Now I'm just waiting, just waiting. Like I said, I'll cut this off at 15 minutes just cause you know, I wanted to get a video out there I don't really feel too well today. I'm not in the best of conditions, but you know, it's. I wanted to get something. I wanted to get something out there. Ooh, Bishop of this place. Promote peace and order. Uh, yeah, promote peace and order. Sure, whatever. Don't care. Those kind of uh, events don't really interest me. I, I'm sure they're useful, and I'm sure they have a point. But you know, I care about like the big, the big events, not the little ones. You know, I did get an advisor out of that, but I'm probably not going to use him. Because the theologian doesn't really benefit me. We learned about some more places. Nice, 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 nice. The Mamluks are huge. Look at that. They are some some kind of huge uh, empire right there. Head jazz. Almost. Well, they, they have... Well, they could get... Um, well, what is this place, this place right here? This is... Jolly Reds, all right. Yeah, they could probably take over all of Arabia if they wanted. Uh, they're definitely in a position to do that. That would give them uh, significant leverage over the Middle East, uh, Middle East area type thing. Um, but at the same time, they probably don't have a Casas Belli on. Oman. Ah, Provincial fest Festivals. Good. Alright. I'm sorry my train of thought kind of just died there. Occasionally that happens. Land Technology 29. We have learned about Zapato, Which is good. Because we must find a way to exploit this knowledge. But I'm going to cut this video off here. So, as always, folks. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching, folks.